Well, hello everyone. Welcome to Smells Like. I'm Josh. So good to see you. And today I have my good friend, Stephanie. Steph, thanks for being on the channel. My pleasure. My <laughs> pleasure. And uh, Stephanie, you've been a friend of mine for a really long time. And you're kind of into perfume a little bit, would you say? I would say that until I met you. And then I realized what I, all that I don't know. But yes, I, I do enjoy what are, perfume. What are some that maybe you're into, like your favorites right now? <laughs> okay. Well, uh, I don't have the budget you have. <laughs> I don't have <laughs> so, I don't have much of a budget. so I did buy um, sample oh, sizes yeah. from Le Labo. Oh, cool. And so, Centaur 33. Yeah, awesome. yeah, yeah, that's yeah. probably one of my favorites. I do like rose and I do like the patchouli. Very and when I wear Centaur and patchouli, strangers and students I work with a lot of college students they'll be like what are you just stop and they're like what are you wearing yeah. you smell so good and I'm like well it's not right on, right on. <laughs> well uh, so what I have for us is uh, I keep crazy lists of all the perfumes that I'm into I have a list of perfumes I want to sample in order of the next one I want to sample uh, I have a list of decants of the decants that I want to get um, and then I have most importantly my list of the next bottles that I want to purchase um, and so I have five decants here that I've been wearing these are my top five uh, next bottle that I want to purchase a full bottle of and so what I thought I'd do is have you try these and just kind of see what you think of them, if you like them or not, and then put them in order, and maybe this, you decide for me what my next sure. full Sounds bottle good. purchase is gonna be. All right, so let's see. Uh, let's start here. The first one, this is from Chanel. Okay. Um, it's called Blue to Chanel. Have you heard of Blue to Chanel? Never heard of it? I think I have seen an ad for it. Okay, uh, so yeah. this is pretty popular. Uh, but there are a few different versions of this. This is their newest one, and it's a pure perfume. Supposedly, it's a little bit stronger, deeper version yeah. of this one. Let's let it air out a little bit, and there you go. Hmm. I can smell it in the air. I love this yeah. one. But I don't want to sway your but, opinion. Right, right. Well, you won't. I guess I knew that already. guess I knew that already. There is something in this. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no, yeah. There is something in this. Maybe it's one of those top notes that smells a little bug spray. Really? Yeah. Okay. So. Like a citrus or. This is like, like a, a lemon. Uh, lemon. I think lemon zest. Now I can. Okay. Now I can smell that. I think it just needed to have yeah. a little... You're not the only person that I've heard say that the opening is a little funny. Yeah. It smells a little, like, chemical -y. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Some people have said okay. that. Okay. But this is growing on me. I could see this on my uncle or something. Okay. <laughs> Maybe not. Who are you thinking for your next bottle? <laughs> okay. So it smells good for your uncle. So kind of like run-of-the-mill guy cologne or... Classy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's classy. Okay. Not my favorite. Okay, fair enough. Uh, so the next one, this is from a niche brand uh, called Parfums de Marley. This is Layton. Uh, and as you can see, I worn a lot of this. I just left enough to get the sample. Uh, so this is the end of my. There's the last of it. Right there it there. goes. See what you think of that one. Layton from Parfums de Marley. Oh, I like this one. Okay. This one's nice. So, you know I mean, like, okay, this isn't even a scent. It just makes you think of, like, dark plum and black. Okay. It's got some darkness. Yeah, but yeah. there's, like, a little, also a little, like, <laughs> this is not even the right word. Frosting, like a little sweetness. To okay, it. yeah, yeah. There's definitely some sweetness. And in musky. My... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. There's a lot going on in this one. This one's really nice. I like it. Right on. Okay, so we've got say a thumbs up for this. Yes, one. two thumbs up for that one. 
What about this? Would you give it a thumbs up? Kind of like maybe a middle or It's not? a middle. This is, this is fine. Just it's fine. It's fine. You don't dislike it, but you don't love it. Right. You, you at least like this one. I like that one okay. a lot, yeah. All right, cool. Next one, this is from another niche uh, brand. And niche just means that all they make is perfume. Okay. And this is from the house of Maison Francis Kirkjohn. He is a perfumer. Uh, and this is called Baccarat Rouge 540. Try that one out. This is nice. Mm. Okay, I really like it. This also smells. I could. I think this could go well as a unisex. Oh yeah, for sure. Yeah, for sure. I could. I could sell this on a lady. Oh yeah, I think yeah, and it is I think marketed as um, unisex. It does also smell kind of sweet. Definitely sweet, yeah. yeah. But really, I can't even place what. Some people say it smells a little like, like cotton candy. Oh, I could, yeah. Now that you say that, I could think I yeah I could see that. But not sickly sweet. Yeah, no, no. There's just a little bit of that there, and then. There's a freshness in it mm -hmm. too. Hmm. Sorry, I wish I had more words. No, it's okay. This, this one is this one is hard to explain. You know, I wouldn't know how to explain it because if you tell somebody it smells like cotton candy, that's not really no. It doesn't really sum it up. But I can't tell what else is going on in there. But it is really nice. I wish you could smell. <laughs> so that one, you think, is a like a love? I like I like I I love these two. They're really well, you love great. these two. Yeah. Okay, so uh, Leighton and Baccarat Rouge. For you. All right, next one is from Tom Ford. This is Tom Ford's um, Noir Extreme for men. Give that one a try. Okay, this one. Kind of a different, yeah, it is different, different thing, yeah, than the others. So. <clears throat> I like more of the, yeah, as some of it's evaporating. At first it smelled a little like, um, like just too heavy perfume, yeah. you know? But yeah. now, it does smell, I think I just like this one. Because it does <laughs> smell almost like too rich yeah. on your senses. Yeah, you know? there's a lot going on with yes. that one too. This makes me think of, um, just maybe the male equivalent of sometimes old ladies that just wear like two. You're like, oh, geez, ladies. Like old, old ladies. Lady perfume. Yeah. Smell? Yeah. Okay. So I think we'll come back to this one. So there's a little bit of a yeah. This one's a little more heavy-handed. I quite I quite like that. One. <laughs> <laughs> All right. The last one here is from Dior. This is Dior Om Parfum. Shake it, shake it. Right. Oh, this one's very different. Yeah, yeah, way different from the others. Yeah. Like, is that some wood scent in there? Definitely. Maybe? Yeah, there's uh, there's wood in it. There's. Yeah, this one. Oh, is a great fall one. Oh yeah. Seriously. Oh yeah, great for cold, cooler weather. Yeah, I mean, it just feels like you're like crunched up some leaves. Yeah. Yeah. And. Uh, this has leather in it. Yep, I was just gonna go there. Yeah, like old, some old leather bound books. Yeah. That's this nice. one also has um, a floral note called Iris that some people say smells a little bit like um, like lipstick or like makeup. Yeah. You get that a little bit? Yes, I do. It smells kind of cosmetic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That That's the part that's, it could be better. Yeah, Maybe. yeah, but yeah. throw you off a little bit. Yeah. No, but I do like that one. Yeah, this one is really blended well. It, this one wears well. And these all are going to wear a little bit different than they are just like on the paper. Sure. Your body chemistry. Yeah, for sure. Okay, so at this point, if you had to choose, like, what are your top three? Yeah. We know you, you kind of like the Blue de Chanel, right? Yeah, I think these are my top three. These two, three. These three. Okay, so let's so let's get rid of 
Let's but I do want to smell that one again. You want to smell like okay, just... it? Alright. Yeah, we'll revisit those then okay. in a minute. Alright. Let's kind of go back and see. I'm just curious of these three. Yeah, me too. You know, what your know. favorite one? If you had to choose one. I really do think this is my favorite. Okay, the late. Yeah. Uh, it's a crowd pleaser for sure. Uh, yeah, there's a lot going on in this one. I do really, really like that one. Okay, you think this is your favorite? I think. I mean, I, these are all great options. Okay. All right. Josh. So you would approve. Great. Yes, I would approve. I would approve. These three. So Par Parfums Marley Layton, uh, MFK's Back Rich Street 40, and Your Own Parfum are Stephanie approved for the Sense Like Fragrance channel. Which one, if Gosh, you had to this choose? This really <laughs> It is. Maybe that one, these, actually. These are rock stars. These are... I think... You think you can eliminate this? Sure. With your, it's nice. It goes in a much... It's pretty unique. It mm -hmm. goes in a different direction. It's pretty heavy, too, when you wear it. The leather in it and... Um, I forget what all else, but... Yeah, it, it wears a little heavy, but it is really well done, like really high end. I know it looks like I changed my mind. I think I did. I think my pick for you. Okay. My top pick is is this one. Okay, background reach. Yeah. Well, I won't argue with that. I do love that one. All right, I, I, it has been chosen. I guess I'll be. We have a champion. Hey, I'm okay with that. Getting background reach by forty next. Um, well, I think that's it then for this one. Unique. Right? All right. Unique. Layton and Baccarat Rouge 54. Thanks so much for being yeah, on the so channel. Fun. That was really fun. Appreciate it. So, hey, guys, give a thumbs up for Stephanie down below. And if you want to do this again sometime, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And we'll see you right here at the Smells Like Fragrance channel for another video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye. Cool.